again with this corner. It's going to place it right on the edge of the cusp of the semicircle on that far side. He's going to drive it in this time towards Pierce. Pierce heads it down, and it goes in. It's in the back of the net. It's Christian Pierce. Matt Green was stood in front of Flinders, and I can tell you now, we had a shadow of a doubt that it was Matt Green's perhaps perception of standing in front of Flinders that made it difficult for the Minstermen keeper to get down to his right hand side. I think one or two of the York players might have suggested there was obstruction there, but he was onside. There was nothing illegal about where he was standing, and that probably, Martin, makes Flinders slightly unsighted. But a great powering header from the big man, the former Knotts man, Christian Pierce, puts Mansfield back on level terms with 31 on the clock. Well, Mansfield certainly didn't deserve that, Nigel, but we, we sense Mansfield coming back into the game. What a fantastic header that is from Christian Pierce from fully 12 yards out. He's absolutely powered it into the, the bottom left corner. I would have thought the goalkeeper wouldn't be terribly happy happy to be beaten by a header from that distance, but as you said, he might have had a Mansfield player in front of him. Uh, but I